What's going on, guys? Kevin here from Sportsbox. Breaks coming at you live Monday afternoon, doing an afternoon session here. New Year's Day, January 1st, 2018, which feels pretty weird to say. Uh, today, we are breaking 2017-18 Panini Court Kings basketball. Choose team, uh, case break number one. This one has taken us a while to get filled. Basketball product has not been filling super fast uh, the last two seasons even, so... Hopefully we can turn that around, guys. If you're breaking with us and you like what we do, uh, you know, do feel free to come on out. We break, uh, you know, five to six nights a week here. So would love to have you in our breaks multiple times throughout the week. Um, who has who in this break? The Atlanta Hawks belongs to Stuart D. The Boston Celtics, Mark W. The Brooklyn Nets going to James W. The Charlotte Hornets going to Dean A. Uh, the Chicago Bulls going to Dean A. The Cleveland Cavs going to Crazy Chilla. The Dallas Mavericks going to Chris L. The Denver Nuggets going to Chris. Um, just to point out, guys, we have two different Chris L's. So the Dallas Mavericks go to Chris L E. The Denver Nuggets go to Chris L A. And I'll I'll designate that as we go if I come across more of that. Um, the Detroit Pistons going to uh, Timothy F. The Golden State Warriors going to Lonnie L. Houston Rockets going to Dean A. Indiana Pacers Chris L A. The Los Angeles Clippers going to James W. The Los Angeles Lakers going to Mike S. The Memphis Grizzlies, Chris L.A. The Miami Heat going to Edward D. The Milwaukee Bucks going to Mike S. Minnesota T-Wolves, Mike S. New Orleans Pelicans going to Stephen A. The New York Knicks going to Chow, Chow Eddie. I think, that's, uh, I think that's the name. Chow Eddie going for the Knicks. The Oklahoma City Thunder going to Mike S. The Orlando Magic going to Ryan B. <clears throat> Philadelphia 76ers, Chris L.E. The Phoenix Suns going to Ryan B. The Portland Trailblazers, Philip J. Sacramento Kings going to Bradley A. The San Antonio Spurs going to Stephen L. Toronto Raptors going to Eddie D. Utah Jazz going to Jeremy T. And the Washington Wizards going to Mike S. Um... I'm just seeing your uh, your message up there, Hitless. Um, if you click on the link being posted in the chat, it'll take you directly to our website. But here is a direct link. Um, they are pick your team style, so each team is priced accordingly. So they're not the same, uh, you know, the same price hit list. But if you click on that link right there, you're going to see the prices on the Bowman's vest. You're going to see the Rockies are in there for ten bucks. Uh, Kansas City Royals are in there for nineteen, and so on. So just go ahead, click on that link. It's going to take you to the website where you can. Uh, Sign up an account, snag up some of those team spots, guys. All right, here we go. Court Kings. What do we got in this? In Court Kings, we are looking at each box has one auto, one memorabilia card, and two rookies. 16 boxes, one pack per box, and 10 cards per pack. So 160 cards in total. <clears throat> Notorious RB, what's up, buddy? Happy New Year to you as well, my friend. Happy New Year to you as well. All right, guys, here we go. It's been a long time coming. We've been waiting for this one to fill for for a fair bit of time, guys. Fair bit of time. Hopefully, we can, uh, like I said, keep the magic going with some more basketball. Basketball is fun to break, but I'll be honest, I'm so out of the loop that uh, I don't even know who the hot guys are in the 17-18 class. So as we're going here, if I pull something really hot, you guys tell me that this is one of the hot guys in the uh, in the rookie class this season. Tatum, Ball. Yeah, keep it going, Stu. Definitely. That's good information for me because I am really out of the loop with these guys. Last guys I knew were like Carl Anthony Towns and, uh, you know, Wiggins because that was the last basketball crowd we had coming in. Here it is, fellas. Here it is. Court Kings. So there's Lorenzo Ball right on the right on the top cover, right? I forgot we got these suckers we're dealing with in each one of these, the toppers, right? All right. So we have one pack per box along with the box topper. So I think what I'm going to do, fellas, is uh, bear with me for a sec. I'm really disorganized here today. This, In case you guys, if you weren't with me yesterday, you'll hear it in my voice. I'm sick as a dog, actually. I've had this nasty cold going on for over a week, and it's kind of kicking my butt. 
So I'm running at slow motion for sure. So what I'm going to do, fellas, is I'm going to open up all 10 of these boxes, okay? I'm going to pull out the pack, and I'm going to pull out the box topper, and then we'll bust through everything accordingly once I get it all pulled out of the boxes. It's going to be a little easier, a little more room to work with on the break table here. Let me keep them in view because I don't want you guys to think we're pulling a sleight of hand here. I think that's happened with some guys. Some, some jackasses have tried to pull that kind of stuff. There's three. Oh goodness, guys! I took some uh, I took some cold medicine right before I started here, guys. Oh, you're welcome, Hitless. Thank you. If you came in on a spot, appreciate it, my friend. Appreciate it. If uh, if by chance you can't find your login information, there's a password retrieval function built onto the site as well, so you can just. Uh, Retrieve your password and get yourself logged in correctly if it's been a while. You bet, my friend. Good to have you. Good to have you. These box toppers are neat, but what happens with these box toppers is we then have to... Uh, I have to basically fabricate like cardboard... Or something rigid when I'm shipping those out. Otherwise, they'll get bent in the mailers. Uh, Hitless, we do it. We have personals of everything on the site that shows up that says personals. I don't physically have them here. We break out of two different locations. I'm in Vegas. The other half of the operation is Jason. He's out of Pennsylvania. Jason has all of our personals at his location in PA. But snag up any of them that you're interested in. He's, he'll break them today for you. So he will break them today. Just uh, it won't happen here during this particular session. He'll break them today though for sure. You know what I'll do guys? I'll do five and five. How's that? So we're not sitting here just opening boxes and not looking at the fun stuff. We'll do five and five. Man, oh man, I hope this, uh, so this cold cough, whatever the heck it is, has been with me for a week, and I could feel like I'm running a fever or something with this thing. Not good. All right, guys, so I'll leave the toppers right there for the second, and let's crack open the packs first. So what do we got in each pack? We got one auto and one memorabilia. Is that what we're looking at? One auto, one memorabilia card, and two rookies per pack. All right. Here we go, fellas. Good luck, good luck. It, As I said, Stu, it's a full case. I'm just doing half and half just to give myself a little, little bit of work room here. It is a full case. 16 boxer. <clears throat> All right, guys, give me a sec here. Okay, here we go, fellas. Here we go. So again, you get all cards pulled for your team when you break with us. You're not only getting stuff that's numbered. You're not only getting stuff that has autos and such on it. So I'll show you my best here. So turn back of card over for rookies, please. Uh, that's a decent black border. All right, what do we got here, you guys? Justin Patton. Justin Patton for the Minnesota T-Wolves. So Minnesota T-Wolves. All right, guys, and here comes our first something something, and check it out. How about a Frank Jackson? Frank Jackson, fresh paint auto for the Pelicans. He looks a little confused in that picture. He's like, what are you doing? Why are you taking my picture and then painting it? Frank Jackson for the Pelicans is our first auto. And uh, guys, here we go. <laughs> he looks confused on the court too. Lorenzo Ball for the Lakers is going to be our memorabilia card. There it is, guys. Lorenzo Ball, Art Nouveau. Art Nouveau 
for the Lakers. And uh, Stu's calling out a boom on that one. It'd be nice if it had ink on it. It'd be nice if it was lower numbered or just numbered in general, but not too bad. He's the man, right? He is the man, Lorenzo Ball. Who's got him? L.A. Lakers in this one belong to Mike S. There you go, Mike, picking up a little Lorenzo Ball action to start us off. All right, guys. Box number one in the books. Like I said, I'm going to do all the box toppers. I'll do all the box toppers after we get through this five packs. Then we'll do the whole second uh, second uh, batch. It's 16, rather. 16 boxes. I'm confusing myself here, fellas. Don't mind me. So we'll do eight, then we'll do the toppers, and then we'll do the other eight. Fair deal? All right. James Harden, Anthony Davis. What do we got here? Anthony Davis points in the paint. Pelicans versus Hawks. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, Derek White. And what do we got? Portraits of Marcus All for the Grizzlies, number to 175. So the numbering's on the back, it appears, right? And here we go, guys. For the Brooklyn Nets, 40 of 399. Chris Levert. Chris, and that has ink too, sketches and swatches. Chris Levert, Brooklyn Nets, sketches and swatches with ink. Numbering to 399. Right behind it, what do we got, guys? What do we got? De'Aaron Fox. Is it Darren or De'Aaron? I don't know. Some of these names are a little tough to pronounce. Another top rookie. <clears throat> that is a Sacramento Kings, fellas. Sacramento Kings with an Art Nouveau. It is De'Aaron. Gotcha. So De'Aaron Fox with an Art Nouveau. And the final two. Uh, Trevor Booker and a John Wall for the Wizards. All right, guys. Two packs in. Pack number three. Guys, if you're popping in, welcome. We appreciate having you. And uh, if you want to, why don't you sign up for uh, an account on our site and join our breaks today. I'm going to give you the link right here to sign up for an account on the site, fellas, because I know we get a lot of new faces in here the last couple of days. So there's the link to uh, sign up an account on the site. And here is the link to everything we're trying to get filled up. Obviously, the Court Kings you're going to see sitting at uh, zero because that is fully sold out. But there's the link right there to everything else we're trying to get filled up. High-tech baseball, Bowman's Best Baseball. If you want to keep the basketball love going, we have Ascension Basketball up there. Absolute, the brand new Absolute Basketball. So we got a lot of goodies. A lot of goodies to potentially uh, break today. We just need them to fill all the way. So if you guys want to see some stuff go, snag up some teams. Let's do it, guys. What do we got here, fellas? What do we got here? Malik Monk. That's a pretty cool card. We've got a portrait of Tobias Harris. Numbering on that is to 175. And what do we got here, guys? Utah Jazz. Tony Bradley for the Jazz. Tony Bradley for the Jazz. That is an on-card auto. Fresh paint. Tony Bradley. Utah Jazz. And uh, here we go, guys. You might have heard of this gentleman. Anthony Davis, Artistic Endeavors. This is a 15 of 299. That's going to be the relic. A little AD action for the Pelicans. Artistic Endeavors. All right. All right, guys. Next pack. We're going to do 8 and 8, like I said. <clears throat> Wrong Jazz rookie, Stu. Which one's the uh, the hot guy in the, on the Jazz right now? <clears throat> Lorenzo, <laughs> I'm looking at your message over on uh, Twitch. Oh, my voice! I can't even speak, guys. I took uh, I took a whole gaggle of cough medicine before I started up here because I'm hurting so bad. Uh, Jared Allen, <clears throat> Court Kings, Carmelo. That Carmelo is the portraits to 175. And here's some Kings love. Sacramento Kings again. Justin Jackson. Justin Jackson for the Kings. That is the auto. Fresh paint auto. Those are on card for the Kings. And here comes our next one, guys. Dennis Smith Jr. Dennis Smith Jr. for the Mavs. And that's a pretty cool uh, patch right there. Dennis Smith Jr. 
Art Nouveau for the Dallas Mavericks. Oh, I don't even see the numbering blended right in there, guys. That's the 25. That's a 13 of 25. 13 of 25 on that one. Very nice. That numbering snuck right it right past me. Keeping it going, guys. Keeping it going. All right, fellas. Here we go. Is his last name Bacon? Dwayne Bacon. Renaissance men of Carl Malone. Lorenzo Ball with the Court Kings. Marcus saw portraits. Uh, these portraits are numbered, right? To 175. 98 of 175 on the portraits. And our auto, it looks like, is going to be San Antonio Spurs with a Derek White. Derek White. Little inscription with his number there. Derek White for the Spurs. There you go. He's got quite the uh, quite the haircut going on there, Derek. Fresh paint. And next up, guys, Harrison Barnes. It looks like we're uh, we're getting Dallas love again here. This one's numbered to 299, 176 of 299. Artistic endeavors. Dallas Mavericks with the Harrison Barnes. All right, three packs to go out of the first half. He has a following, Stu. Nice. Very nice, very nice. All right, let's keep going here, guys. Oh, Lonzo. Lonzo? Ah, whatever. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm all jacked up on cough medicine, and I can't pronounce the, uh, the names to begin with. I'm like, let me see here. Listen to my uh, my chest. I can barely breathe. What do we got here? These guys' names, man. That's a Steph Curry. What the heck is the uh, Dicey Migliord? All right. Portraits to 175. Devin Booker. TJ Leaf. TJ Leaf for the Pacers. It's a fresh paint auto. Pacers haven't hit yet. That's numbered as well, guys. 23 of 100. 23 of 100. TJ Leaf. Oklahoma City Thunder. Terrence Ferguson. That is the relic card. Art Nouveau for the OKC Thunder. And let's keep going. Keeping it going. Renaissance men, Baylor, old school Lakers action. <clears throat> How about some Brooklyn Nets, Jared Allen, DeAndre Jordan, portraits, that's to 175, 17 of 175 for the Clippers, and Jared Allen again, Brooklyn Nets, this is going to be the auto, Brooklyn Nets, auto, fresh paint. Next up, guys, Kyle Lowry, Toronto Raptors, Art Endeavors, 114 of 299. 114 of 299, Kyle Lowry. <coughs> Love the headband. <coughs> oh, I'm hurting. There's Ben Simmons, who I believe is what? He's exclusive with his autos and such to upper deck. If I'm not mistaken, right? All right, guys, we're still going here. Emerging artists. Portraits of Josh Hart for the Lakers. That's a lower number, 65 on that one, 13 of 65. And right behind it, how about Josh Hart Otto? Josh Hart for the Lakers, Otto, Court Kings. There it is. Fresh paint on card Otto for the Lakers. New York Knicks coming up. How do you pronounce that last name? I'm not even going to try. <clears throat> you want either of the other two? And there we go, guys. Art Nouveau <clears throat> for the New York Knicks. New York Knicks score in here. All right, guys, let's check out these uh, box toppers. See what we got on the toppers. 
We'll look at eight toppers, then we'll do the same thing with the full second half. These toppers are sometimes tough to open. All right, first topper is a Jeremy Lin for the Brooklyn Nets. Tough to even show these things are so big. Jeremy Lin, Brooklyn Nets is our first topper. Panoramics. <clears throat> All right, there's one. Here comes our second one, LeBron, LeBron James, Cleveland Cavs, panoramics there also. I'm trying to do this, there we go. Well, this is interesting. David West over the, uh, what do we got? Over the course of four teams going back to 2003 career all the way up to current day. So you got the, uh, the Hornets, the Pacers, the Spurs, and the Warriors. Progressions, David West. Let me see if this card, normally, <clears throat> Normally, when it's not numbered 50 or better, it doesn't have an auto on it, doesn't have a relic on it. We would not run it through the randomizer because it's not technically a hit. So these toppers are not technically a hit. So this one would usually fall top to bottom, left to right. So the top left team would be Golden State Warriors, even though he falls across multiple teams. <clears throat> so I'm going to check out the checklist on that one and see if it... Uh, if it designates a specific team if not we're going to go the top to bottom left to right on it which is uh the way we publicize all of our stuff russell westbrook oklahoma city thunder panoramics there yeah typically Stu, if it's numbered 50 or better so if it falls into what would what would be considered a hit we would always randomize it um when it's not technically a hit, we do not randomize them because it just turns into a, just an absolute ton of busy work. Uh, Carl Anthony Towns, Minnesota T-Wolves. Panoramics on the Carl Anthony Towns. Yeah, it's, uh, it's publicly listed. Actually, we're dealing with another one here, too. So if this is going to be somewhat regular occurrence then I definitely will just go top to bottom, left to right. J.R. Smith, we got the same kind of situation here. Is that the same card? What did we have? David West was our last guy. J.R. Smith on this one again. Hornets on the left. Uh, that's the back side, though. We go front side. So Cleveland Cavs is our top left team and the uh, furthest left on the face of the card. So progressions, and again, it's the same kind of thing where there's four distinct teams going on here across the guy's career. So we are going top to bottom, left to right on this because it's not technically a hit. Cleveland Cavs is the team on the far left there, fellas. Russell Westbrook, Oklahoma City Thunder, Panoramics. These toppers. And we have the Washington Wizards with John Wall. Panoramics. All right, guys, that's the first eight boxes. Let's look at the second eight now. Here we go, guys. Second eight boxes coming up. Let's peel off the top. Yeah, Ryan, that is not Lorenzo at all. That is absolutely not Lorenzo at all. I don't know what's wrong with me. 
<laughs> I, bl I blame it on the cold meds. Lonzo Ball. Oh, man. I am hurting. This is not going to be... Yesterday we did like a, a six-plus hour session, maybe... Maybe uh, almost even seven hours from start to finish. But... Uh, Oh, the topper's flying out. Today is not going to be that because I am feeling the pain of this cough cold congestion thing that I'm working with. So today's probably going to be a normal like three hour session. <clears throat> or I might be calling the paramedics here. Topper. Court Kings. So a couple seasons ago, we had such a basketball crowd. Jason and I used to make jokes like, man, we should almost just specialize in basketball anymore because all of our guys want to do is break basketball. We'd go live with like 26 spots remaining in a basketball break. And uh, it would sell out within the first, like, I don't know, first half hour, 40 minutes. That has not been the case for quite a while now with basketball. The 16-17 basketball rookie class really shot, you know, shot all that momentum down to nothing. Um, this one, the 17-18 rookie class is very good, but, but uh, we're still feeling the hurt from last year's slow-moving stuff. Yeah, the Ben Simmons thing really killed it last year. It, it, well, Ben Simmons is exclusive, Stu, so we couldn't get our hands on Ben Simmons because you need a physical card shop uh, to get your hands on Upper Deck product. And we do not have a physical card shop. Our full operation is online. So you can't get the Ben Simmons stuff if you don't have a card shop, and it doesn't behoove us to get a card shop just so we can get the Ben Simmons stuff. Yeah. Anything Simmons was big. I mean, yeah, but when you're not getting autos of them, guys just aren't buying. Guys just, you know, weren't buying at the pace that uh, we expected. So, <clears throat> 16, 17 stuff did not go over great. All right, guys, here we go. Let's do the cards and then the toppers. <coughs> Bring in the backup, Tommy. Oh, man, I, I really wish I had a backup. I wish I had a backup. Jason is, uh, you know, we back each other up, but he's got stuff going on today, so he couldn't even take over the stream. We got a points card coming up right there. It's 900. What the heck kind of redemption? What kind of card was that going to be? Mike Conley, Portraits, Grizzlies, that's to 175. Here's the card. That was going to be the auto. That 900 points was going to be the auto. The relic is Frank Kaminsky, Performance Art. Hornets versus Pelicans, that is a Hornets card. 117 of, oh, my bad, guys. That's kind of a bonus because there's one and one. So here is the relic, right? Right behind it is a Sketches and Swatches of Rod Strickland with ink. Sketches and swatches for the Wizards. Rod Strickland with ink. That's a 136 of 299. So that would be our two hits. The one has ink. And then, so this is kind of a bonus. 900 points card. So I'll have to do a, uh, an inventory of who got hits and who did not get hits in the break. And we will divvy out that 900 points card based on it. But that's a big points card, guys. Big points card. <clears throat> yeah, right? The case hit at 900 points? I don't know. That's a big points card, though. All right. Let's keep going here, fellas. I mean, if nothing else, it's kind of a bonus, like I said, because uh, the auto was, in fact, there. Uh, points in the paint, Magic versus Pistons. John Collins. This is the guy you were calling out for, John Collins, before? 
Uh, CJ McCollum for the Trailblazers portraits. That's the 25. Nice low number for the Trailblazers. 19 of 25. And here is our auto, guys. Dennis Smith Jr. again, Mavericks. Dennis Smith Jr. for the Mavericks. That is on card. Fresh paint auto. And uh, Justin Patton for the uh, Minnesota T-Wolves. Minnesota T-Wolves relic. Art Nouveau. All right. Keeping it going, guys. <clears throat> Oh, man. Hurting. I am hurting. What do we got? Donovan Mitchell, emerging artist of Randall for the Lakers. Uh, here he is again. He looks like he's, uh, he's angry. He's angry. Portraits, 35 of 65. And here he is again, guys. Sacramento Kings, De'Aaron Fox. For the Sacramento Kings. And that is a nice little on card fresh paint auto for the Kings. Boom. George Hill, guys. George Hill Artistic Endeavors 115 of 299. So Sacramento Kings getting both of them in this one. This one's a George Hill Artistic Endeavors relic. Sacramento Kings followed right behind that Fox Kings auto. All right, keeping it going. Big auto there, Stu. Nice, nice, nice. Congrats to the owner of the Kings. Who owns them? Who owns them, owns them, owns them? Sacramento Kings in this one. That's Bradley A. There you go, Brad. All right, Dirk Nowitzki. Uh, Norman Powell. Portraits of Willie Callie Stein to 175 on that one. And what do we got here, guys? What do we got here? Dennis Smith Jr. for the Mavericks. Sketches and swatches with ink. Sketches and swatches with ink. Dallas Mavericks. 264 of 299 right there. Uh, Patty Mills, Artistic Endeavors, 281 of 299. Pretty cool little swatch of something going on there. San Antonio Spurs Artistic Endeavors. <clears throat> All right. Emerging artist Bobby Portis. Uh, Josh Hart. Portraits, and that's a portrait to 25 as well. Very nice, 0-3 of 25, Utah Jazz. And uh, Utah Jazz right behind it with another sketches and swatches, I believe. Donovan Mitchell, Donovan Mitchell. Stu's giving a big boom in the chat. That's the big hit, the Donovan Mitchell's the big one. And there it is, guys. Donovan Mitchell, sketches and swatches with ink. Utah Jazz. Utah Jazz, $200 card, excellent, excellent, excellent. $259 of $399 on the numbering on that one, guys. And the Utah Jazz in this one belong to Mr. Jeremy T. There you go, Jeremy. Jeremy, I'm pulling some good stuff for you the last couple of days, buddy. Hopefully you come out of that retirement. Artistic Endeavors, Alfred Payton, Orlando Magic, $265 of $299. All right, three packs to go here, guys, plus all the toppers left to crack open. <coughs> yeah, sick personal case, right? No John Collins, looking for the John Collins. What do we got? Donovan Mitchell, emerging artists. Got our portraits. Portraits is to 175. Next one up, guys. Jonathan Isaac. Jonathan Isaac. Sketches and swatches. That is the Orlando Magic. 58 of 399. 58 of 399 on that one. Number five overall pick. Excellent. 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 Orlando Magic. Guys, Jeremy Lynn. 
Artistic Endeavors, 143 of 299. Jeremy Lin. That is the relic. Brooklyn Nets. Two packs to go here, fellas. Two packs to go. <clears throat> Guys, do make sure to hit that follow. If you're watching us on Breakers, I see we have a pretty sizable crowd going on. Follow button's right down there. Please do hit that follow button. Also, guys, here is the full link. It's going to take you to everything we're trying to get filled up today. I will keep this break session going as long as you guys keep filling stuff. So there's the link to it right there. You do need an account on our website to make a purchase. Sign yourself up for one. It's free. It takes a minute. So let's, uh, let's keep the breaks going, guys. This will be the first of uh, several, hopefully. Renaissance Men of Clyde Drexler. Carmelo, that is the portraits. That's to 175. And didn't we just pull him? Did we pull him two cards ago? We did. Here he is again. Jonathan Isaac, one more time. Jonathan Isaac for the Orlando Magic, 300 of 399. That is the sketches and swatches. And that's got a little pinstripe action too. Jonathan Isaac times two. Orlando Magic in short order. Bradley Beal, Artistic Endeavors, 231 of 299, Washington Wizards. Washington Wizards, Bradley Beal. All right, guys, one pack left, and then we got the eight box toppers to crack open. Then we got the 900 points card to random off. All right, here it is. Final pack. <coughs> Final pack here, guys. Seven very good in a row. Yeah, pretty good stuff, right, Stu? The second half has been pretty solid. Emerging artist, Chris Levert. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Luke Kennard. Kennard? Portraits. That is to 175. And uh, how about this guy? How about this guy? This is going to be sketches and swatches with ink on it. Seven of 199, Carl Anthony Towns, T-Wolves. And boom! What a second half of the case, right? Carl Anthony Towns, sketches and swatches. Very nice. And again, numbering on that one, guys, is a 7 of 199. Very nice. Minnesota T-Wolves crushing it. Who's got them T-Wolves? That's Mike S. There you go, Mike. Congrats, buddy. Congrats. And the last hit is C.J. McCollum, Portland Trailblazers. Trailblazers <laughs> versus Rockets. What do we got on this one? Performance art, C.J. McCollum, Trailblazers versus Rockets, November 17th, 2016. Pretty cool card. And then we got these two. Let's look at these toppers. Let's see if we get anything surprising here on the toppers, guys. How about Carl Anthony Towns making an appearance? Nice. <clears throat> hey, Rosie. Yeah, the, uh, the Bowman draft. We've had some hot cases recently, guys. Hot cases indeed. All right, guys, first topper out of this side. How about some old school trailblazer? Bill Walton. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? What's up? How about Bill Walton, autoed topper? Wow. Get a nice auto out of that, too? How about Bill Walton, Portland Trailblazers with, uh, yeah, how about that? Did not expect to turn that over and see an auto on it. That is amazing. Congratulations. Who's got them Trailblazers? Portland Trailblazers belongs to Philip J. There you go, Philip. Congratulations, my friend. That's an awesome hit. All right, let's keep these toppers going. Is there one auto to topper per case, Stu? Is that what goes on with this stuff? Or is it not even? How about Kevin Durant coming up on the next one? Kevin Durant, Golden State. Golden State panoramics on the Kevin Durant. Uh, it is one auto. One auto topper per, uh, per case. LeBron James <clears throat> panoramics.
Dirk Nowitzki, Dallas Mavs, Panoramics. LeBron again. LeBron James, one more time. Lots of LeBron. Panoramics again. Almost just knocked over the whole stack of cards. That would not have been cool. Three toppers left to crack open. This and two more, guys. This plus two more. All right, guys. What do we got here? DeMarcus Cousins. And again, we're going to follow the same uh, thing. These aren't technically hits unless they had an auto on them. So this one is not a hit. So when it's not a hit, we go top to bottom, left to right on the team designation when there's multiple teams on it. So the Pelicans do show up on top left. So this will be a Pelicans card. Progressions. DeMarcus Cousins. If it was numbered 50 or better, had numbering on it 50 or better, or an auto, it would. Uh, we'd send it through the randomizer to determine ownership. <clears throat> Hey, thanks a bunch, Stu. Thanks for coming out, buddy. And what do we got? James Harden, Houston Rockets. Panoramics. And final topper, guys. Final topper. Final topper is Jeremy Lin for the Brooklyn Nets. And that is a panoramics as well. So Jeremy Lin is the final topper. All right, guys, that does it for Court Kings number one. We did pull this 900 points card, so I have to do an inventory to see which teams got hits and which teams did not get hits. And uh, set up a random on this one accordingly, because that's a big boy. That's a big points card right there. So look for that one to be posted in addition to the main video. So you'll see the main video. You'll see another one uh, just entitled uh, Court Kings number one dash random. And that'll be where I set that up for the points, uh, the points distribution. All right, guys, thanks again. Appreciate it.